to the next dimension. Hey guys, this is Undercover Dudes all the way from Down Under with the second episode on to how to grow your channel. Now I know there's a lot of YouTubers that are small, like me. In comparison to YouTubers like Raylene Johnson, Smosh, PewDiePie, the vast majority of YouTubers on YouTube are extremely small. We are not known, we have a small fan bases, but we need, you know, some tips along the way in order to get somewhere on the YouTube stratosphere, in order to get known, be known for you to be 100 subscribers, 1,000 subscribers, 10,000, 100,000. These tips I'm going to give you will apply to all. If you want to watch my first episode, I talk about being confident, clear, knowledgeable and original and I think those tips really helped out some guys that definitely got, took them into their videos in order to make them much higher quality than what they were beforehand. So if you guys want to watch that, there's some really good tips in that. But this episode, I'm going to be talking about some different stuff. You know, going away from like the whole voice and stuff like that, the whole mental state, rather being, you know, along the lines of the actual video themselves and how you have to be very persistent, you have to have good quality, be it video and audio, be entertaining, have, have to have fun, obviously, and along with collaborating. Those are the five things I'm going to be talking about today. The first thing is by far one of the most key to any YouTube channel, and that's being persistent. Most younger, not younger, most YouTubers that start YouTube in this age, I'm not saying younger in terms of age, I'm talking about younger, that people start YouTube now rather than a while back, they think they can get viral. Just upload a Minecraft video, upload a Harlem Shake, oh my jeez, you know, upload a Harlem Shake video, and then boom, you're going to go and get viral. It doesn't work like that. Some people will, the very, very, very lucky percentage, like the 0.0000001% will get lucky and get viral and then their channels will take off and explode and all that. But the majority of us won't. Then you have to go and resort to option B, and that is being persistent and consistent. Persistent being that you have to continually upload. Even though it may look bleak, you may say you have 10 subscribers, but I had 10 subscribers, everybody had 10 subscribers one day, but then they kind of took off. They did the stuff that I'm going to tell you guys in order to get somewhere on YouTube. And, you know, being persistent is key. If you want to get anywhere on YouTube, you've got to upload videos. You can't just upload one thing, okay, I'll get some views and you know, I'm going to get viral and get a YouTube partnership and all of that. It doesn't work like that. You have to be consistent, you have to be persistent, you have to upload on a very strict, though it can be a bit loose depending on the size of your channel. For me, I'm a bit lazy with mine, but you know, I kind of try to keep on a basis of a video every two days depending on what I do. But for some people, that may be a video a week, whatever. The more videos you upload, the more exposure you're going to get on YouTube. Now, that links directly into having good video quality. If that is one thing that I have to have to stress, is having good quality is absolutely key in order to get anywhere on YouTube. If you have, you know, 240p video and the crappiest mic alive, not alive, crappiest mic ever existent in, on this earth, then you're not going to get anywhere. People are just going to click your video, listen for about a second, and then leave, and you're not going to get the view. You have to YouTube. YouTube has actually put some out, um, algorithms in where they have to watch for a certain, you know, certain percentage of time in order to go in for that view to register. So people clicking on your video, watching it for a second, and leaving, it doesn't count anymore. You know, some people have those spam videos where the thumbnail looks like some very attractive young lady, and then it turns out to be a gaming video of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. It doesn't work out that way anymore, and those people don't get the views and the money. So, I have to go and stress, good audio, good video. Get those key. There's some very, very, very good tutorials on YouTube. I've got a tutorial myself using Windows Movie Maker, a free free software, using a free software called, what's it called, MSI Afterburner for recording your videos if you're doing gaming. There's a lot of stuff you can do for absolutely no money. Absolutely no money, you can get started doing some really good 720p videos. A link will be in the description below to my tutorial. Now, entertaining 
is another key. And I can't go and say, be entertaining. There you go. Go off, go off. Be entertaining. I can say, have good quality. You can learn, have good quality. You can be persistent by continually uploading. But entertaining is something that you've got to go and learn in yourself. And that links back to my first episode, being confident, clear, knowledgeable, and original. Those are the key elements in order to be entertaining on YouTube. So being entertaining is all jet down to that. And that's one thing I've got to say. If you're not entertaining, people are not going to watch you. That's simple. You can be the most persistent person. You can have the best quality ever. You could be the most original person ever. But if you know you don't, if, if you're not entertaining, then nobody's really going to watch you. That's just really simple. Now, having fun is of all these of all these things is the most important. If you're not having fun with YouTube, then you're not going to get anywhere. That is simple as that. If you do YouTube simply, simply, simply to just go and get big on YouTube, to get viral, then nothing's going to happen. Your channel is going to stay as flat as your hopes, basically. You're just going to think, okay, I'm going through this game. I don't like this game, but I'm going to do it because I want to get viral. It doesn't work like that. If you're not having fun, then you're not going to get anywhere. And that's just as simple as I'm going to put it. For the people that are doing it, just to get viral, you're not going to get anywhere. I'm sorry that it might be shattering your dreams, some people, but that is the truth to it. The only way to get anywhere on YouTube is to have fun. Look at PewDiePie. He has put so much time into his videos, but he still has fun. Even though Amnesia may not be his you know, most entertaining game in terms of him you know, going and screaming, it's still entertaining in terms of the viewers, but he does a lot of other stuff. He has fun making his videos. That's what you guys have got to do. You guys have got to have fun. I have fun making my videos. You guys have got to have fun making your videos. And if you do all of those things, if all of those things I've just gone and talked about, if you do them to a good extent, then there's something else that can go and boost you up a little bit more. And that's collaboration. Collaborating with other YouTubers in order to get, you know, in order to share subscribers, in order to go and grow together. Now for me, I don't collaborate very well. I'm a very bad per I'm very bad in terms of going up to somebody and asking them, you know, can we do something together? Can I upload on your channel, you upload on my channel, or something like that? You know, I'm very bad. I don't like going and putting myself in those situations. But you guys can if you want. If you have two mates if you've got two mates that you know upload as well, that upload the same type of thing, that's very, very, very key. If you, one person uploads a Minecraft video, other person uploads a Call of Duty videos, those you, those viewer bases don't mix. They're like that instead of like, okay, maybe not that. This is not yeah, okay. Wrong, wrong site, wrong site for that. Okay, <laughs> but basically, collaboration is very important if you want to get. If you want to get bigger with other people, you want to grow together, which is absolutely fantastic. I'm personally bad at it. You guys can be good at it. Just go. If you know somebody, you've been talking to them, and they make videos, you make videos, you guys can go and help each other together, and everything will hopefully go out for the better, and you'll get some more subscribers, which is absolutely fantastic. So hopefully, guys, did enjoy this commentary. It's definitely a very, very, very you know, mentally straining thing to do because I have to think up a lot of stuff in order to go in for you guys. So hopefully you guys did enjoy this commentary. If you did, make sure to go and give it a like rating. I'll continue doing this series, thinking up more stuff for you guys to go and make your channel better because that is what we all want. We want our channels to get better in order to get bigger on YouTube, to get more subscribers and all that type of stuff. Bye for now, it's Undercover Dudes, all the way from Down Under, out.